good to be in something from the ground floor. I can't too late for that. I know. But lately, I'm getting the feeling that I came in at the end. The best is over. Many Americans, I think, feel that way. I think about my father. He never reached the heights like me. But in a lot of ways, he had it better. He had his people. They had their standards. They had pride. Today, what do we got? At first, it felt like ginger ale in my skull. Mr. Soprano? <clears throat> yeah. Any thoughts at all on why you blacked out? I don't know. Stress, maybe. Hey, Dad. Hey. Happy birthday. Thanks, Dad. This isn't going to work. I can't talk about my personal life. Hey, good to see you. There he is. Hiya, Chris. Didn't you admit to Dr. Cusimano that you were feeling depressed? Whatever happened to Gary Cooper? The strong, silent type. He wasn't in touch with his feelings. He just did what he had to do. See, see what they didn't know was once they got Gary Cooper in touch with his feelings, that they wouldn't be able to shut him up. And then it's dysfunction this and dysfunction that. I don't feel nothing. Nothing. Dead. Empty. What is it with you and this obsession with this varsity crap? The other day you said it. And when I was a kid, you told the girl cousins the same thing. It was very hurtful. You don't understand. Make me understand. How are we gonna save this kid? <laughs> Miserable fucking existence. My rotten fucking putrid genes have infected my kid's soul. That's my gift to my son. Can you pull yourself away for once? Your head is filled with this stuff. It's just that it's so much more interesting. Than what? Life. I, uh, I lost my real briefcase. My whole life was in it. Just come say hello. Someday soon, you're gonna have families of your own. And if you're lucky, you'll remember the little moments. Like this. Sometimes you're so naive. What do you think Dad does for a living? Waste management. Do you know any other garbage men who live in a house like this? Uncle Jackie. And why do we call him uncle when he's not even related? He's in Dad's other family. What line of work are you in? Waste management consultant. Are you in the Mafia? Am I in the what? Whatever you want to call it. Organized crime. That's total crap. Who told you that? Dad, I've lived in the house all my life. I've seen police come with warrants. I've seen you going out at 3 in the morning. So you never seen Doc Cusimano go out at 3 in the morning on a call? Did the Cusimano kids ever find $50,000 in Krugerrands and a 45 automatic while they were hunting for Easter eggs? I'm in a waste management business. Everybody immediately assumes you're mopped up. It's a stereotype. 
and it's offensive. Him with those ducks. <laughs> National Geographic. Yeah, right. You showed us yesterday. It's great. This isn't gonna work. I can't talk about my personal life. Finish telling me about the day you collapsed. You said you were in waste management. The environment. Dr. Cusimano, besides being your family physician, is also your next door neighbor. See what I'm saying? I don't know what happened with this fellow. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying. Nothing. We had coffee. He's broken the bolts coming through. So you had coffee. Right. Where's my fucking money, you brick? Where's my fucking money? Hey, Gabriel says we down here for the gabagoo. The gabagoo. I say yeah. The word is your uncle Junior gonna whack pussy my life. We're gonna do a your friend Artie Buko's restaurant. Catholic. We all got different needs. What's different between you and me is you're going to hell when you die. But to raise their glass. I'd be standing here saying to our new boss, Salute. Come on, rat. Who are you? What is this? You took it off. And you broke it. How many times do I gotta say this? I don't want that kind of talk in front of this kid. Grasso, you fight your culo, cozy. But but it's obvious you don't give a shit about my situation or what's happening with me. Otherwise, you won't be shaking me down. It's fucking Jimmy. What? The what? wire. It's fucking Jimmy. What's going on? Go back to sleep. Anthony Soprano, Detective Gaudioso, Essex County. I have a warrant for your arrest. You lied to me! You was going coke with her. She admitted it. So what? I can't relieve stress every once in a while. I don't got enough fucking problems. Yeah, Carmelo? I'm old school. I don't believe in a separation shit and divorce. Even if my wife was going after some fucking immigrant. You fucking pushed me to this. You pushed me to this! Listen to somebody else for a change. Fuck him. Oh, fuck him, my fucking daughter! Oh. Hey, want some Zanfuku like this? Don't do it! What the fuck did I say? Who did this? You want for me, you fucking cocksucker? With my fucking money.